did you know that in Jamaica, if it is that you allow somebody to stay with you, let's say somebody now know to stay, you tell them, yeah, man, come stay with me. In order to get them out of your house, let's say them start behave some way and you can't take it and you want them out and them now come out. And you go to the police station and you're like, I want them out of my house now and they're not coming out. Did you know? You have to go to the court, file something, forget them out, report, report it at the station, go to the court, file something, forget them out. Mm, you know, must report it, but you have to file something at the court, forget them out. Go to court, forget them out. Then the courts are going to give them time to find someone to go before you can get them out of your house. Make it make sense. So you also come stay with me. And I said, okay, yeah, I'm good. You can stay for a month or yeah, you can stay. But then you start do criminal activities, you start on my life. I'm un uncomfortable with you living in my house at this point. So I, I'm saying, all right, your time is up. Like I'm uncomfortable. Or more I'm a space now. It's like you've overstayed. I kind of need my space because you don't seem to be making any effort fine off go. Need my space, bro. Or girl. Or you're just making my life a living hell and you need to come out of my house. You can't make my life a living hell in my own house, bro. The police cannot come and assist you with getting this person out here. I forgot court. I'm telling someone to get them out. Make it make sense. I never felt something get them in. What you mean? What you mean? We made a verbal agreement and I'm uncomfortable now. And I want them out of my house. Me, I pay the bills. I'm my house after me. I'm out of God. True the What? Make it make sense. No wonder so much filing a court, so much cases, to a backlog or something. Because why is that something to go to court for? My place, my way you come out. This system, this court system, have my mind in a twirl. So, if there's any legal person listening, what and watching this, I can give me a little clarity as to why. Tell me, say, I rent somewhere. I went rent somebody somewhere. They're vandalizing the property. They're not paying my rent. Is it the same procedure? Like, they're not paying my rent. Our agreement is to pay rent on this particular time. And they're not paying my rent. They're gone months without paying my rent. And the same thing? Whoa. It's crazy. I did have to come show in this video because this young lady have a whole heap of questions and she needs some answers. Uh, me myself too. I need some answers. I need to see some answers down in the comment section. I'm looking for them man because boy them say social media good and social media bad. You have to know how to use it and you don't know the smartphone, you can't make it smarter than you. We have to go up on the phone and search up for the answers them too. Yeah, research on something. Yeah, because this lady put out this and I'm sure a lot of persons never know these things, not you? Yeah, but if you did know already, comment down below if you have any form of experience regarding situation like this. Somebody they are your place and you can't get them out in the past or present talk to me down in the comment section let us learn from each other let us not bash each other like yo you should have know this ray 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 no you know filter information not no wrong keep each other in the loop not true yeah man so the landlord them I want to know, comment down below and tell me how the situation go if somebody a squat by your place and at, you think it's your time for them go how you deal with it how you go about it and at the same time the police them tell us they don't ha harbors the bed bug them 
Mm? And if you find out, say, look here, you know, say, boy, me spot the infestation, the bed bug infestation from early. Yeah, me see, me see a lot of signs. So guess what? Me go take time, draw away from the person here before it get worse. Yeah, how you go about doing that? Them say no bed bug. Remember, say bed bug or something where hard to get rid of in a man. Yeah, it's like from your spot, say boy, your house infested, you have to make some boom. I'm good at left all that the house there. Because bed bug is hard to get rid of. So let me know if you spot bed bug activities in your place. How you have to get rid of them? Talk to me down in the comment section. Tomorrow, 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 you see. Someday, one day, I will be somebody. I don't want to live my life in a misery. Work hard every day at this tragedy day. Hey, listen to the biggest and the baddest sensation coming out from Jamaica. Your girl, Carissa, representing for Jamaica YouTube TV, baby. Big up yourself. Check out the review. Watch me a bubble up. Wow, go on, JY family. Welcome back. If this is your first time, Please subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon to be notified and like the video, share the video and blast it on your WhatsApp status and share it in your contacts. Yeah man, interact with the video All if you don't like a bone in me, press the dislike button, nothing no wrong, we just want you to interact with the video man, yeah, do the right thing. Now, JY family, we have a whole heap of things to talk about as usual. Now, in Jamaica, we have a... Saying, say, you're too jumpy. Oh, no, if I hear the talk there yet? Yeah, I'm gonna comment down below and tell me if you ever hear somebody say, Yo, you're too jumpy, man. Oh, it's a jumpy, brother. Yeah, no, when them say you're jumpy, that means say you, you, you're too easy to flare up and you know, love the things out of the ordinary, and you know, yeah. More why they take things out of proportion. And Uno can add to it down in the comment section. You know? Yeah. So this article where I'm about to read right now is saying jumpy moves land mobile beach goers in jail and gun charge. <laughs> the St. James police have charged three men and a woman with breach of the firearm act. In re relation to an incident that occurred on a beach in Montego Bay in the parish early on Monday, April 1st, charged with possession of a prohibited weapon and unauthorized possession of ammunition are 26 year old no Ken Rye Gill, otherwise called Ken Neal, a steward of Cunningham Drive, Granville in the parish. And another person, 28-year-old Shaquille Williams, otherwise called Shaker, a delivery man at the Fuller District in Granville, St. James. 19-year-old Tian Blake, otherwise called Tam, of Gun Drive, Granville, St. James. 23-year-old Cheyenne Lee Bennett, Otherwise called Lee, a supervisor of Church Lee and Paradise Nowood in St. James. Report are that about 12.20 a.m. A police team was in the area when they saw a Nissan AD wagon motor car being driven onto the beach compound. The law enforcers were walking towards the vehicle to talk to the driver. As the vehicle was blocking the entrance gate of the beach. You know, hear that? But as the officer approached the vehicle, the four occupants reportedly began to behave in a manner that aroused the cops' suspicion. <laughs> the four were accosted and searched, and as and a search of the vehicle was also conducted during the search a canic c a n i k me must me no gun man me no know about them a gun ya a canic that pronounce right a canic t p 95 elite 9 millimeter pistol 
with a magazine containing 10 9mm rounds and ammunition was reportedly found under the, the rear seat of the motor car. So, all four of them were taken into custody and they were charged after they were interviewed in the presence of their attorney. Their court date is being finalized. So when you hear that, them two jumpy, them two boomy. So the moment the police walk up, them are move jiggy. Them can't stay one place. Them are move jumpy. Yeah, man. Them are act jumpy, man. Now, what the, no, man. Something wrong, man. Oh, you so jumpy, brother. What go on? I mean, give, me, give me a search there. <laughs> John was star. I want to say good job, officers. Yes, man. Big up the officers, them, man. The officers, them, my work. When them work, we have to big them up, you know. Just like when them do the do, we have to call them out, not true. And uh, them don't stop work, you know. Because half of them pop off the big piece of gun there. Half of the boy, them up there. So the officers, them, go down at one place. When we say, yeah, man, right down a hand over to you know. All right, pretty this year. Man charged with brandishing big gun in yard where he and complainant live. Detective from the Hanover Police Division have charged 24 year old. Oh, no, hold on. Another thing, on oh, no, notice the age of these men. On oh, no, notice the age. Them no reach 30 JY family. So, when time you and them look a boy in a nothing, and them tell you, say, me I got dirt you, don't tell them said. Don't tell them said, do it if you think you're bad. Them all do it for true because them got it. Yeah, man, you know if you tell them, say, say, fe. No, sir, don't, don't you dare. If you do that, you're in a problem. Detective from the Hanover Police Division have charged 24-year-old Tevin Cooper, otherwise called Tev, of Ginger Hill, Kingsville, in the parish with assault at Kamala and possession of prohibited weapon in relation to an incident that reportedly occurred in Kingsville District in the parish on Friday, March 29. Reports are that about 9.30 a.m., a man was at home disposing of garbage when Cooper, who lived in the same yard, approached him and allegedly pointed big gun at him. Here you know, pop off a piece and left a piece. A report was made to the police. And an investigation was launched. Cooper was subsequently arrested and charged. His court date is not yet being finalized. On a note, they say, them look at something or some look at petty things, them. Hmm? And I like say, you are about 10 men in a war or something. So guess what? You, you don't have no choice. You have to try to defend yourself. Yeah, the one man in a something man. Why you have to run go go and for gun and all these things? Eh? No, sir. Anyway, talk to me down in the comment section. Tell me what you think. That has nothing to do. So why is his phone in your house though? We haven't gotten to That's that part important. yet. What important is that your son is always on his phone. He's always talking. Ma'am, that is important. I paid a whole bunch of money for that phone. So I don't care about okay, what disrespectful he is. We're not about talking about that right now. School. We're talking about we're school. talking about why my son's phone is in he your house right now. Phone. He keeps talking. He dis he interrupts me, disrespects he, me. Uh-huh. I can see why. I can see why because you stealing phones. Can you go get my son's phone and give it to phones. me? Right, you stealing phones. Let me find out. You flipping phones? No, That's what you're doing, no, taking phones no, from little kids. Phone back when I take no, phone my son gonna get his phone back right now. Bad money. Bad ma'am. I'm I'm 
Listen, no, listen, Miss Green, Miss Green, I'm trying, I'm trying to be nice to you, Miss Green. I'm trying to be nice to you, Miss Green. I'm about to, Miss Green, run me my son's phone. No, no, run me my son's phone. Y'all see this? Y'all see this? Look at it. Yes, I'm gonna record. Yes, I'm gonna record you because you trifling. She's taking. This is Miss Green. She done took my son's phone. I done, I done had iPhone found the phone here, and she won't run me my stuff. Run me my son's phone, ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. You talking about the wrong thing, yo? I, I swear, yo. Listen, I'm telling you. Listen to me. If you don't run me my phone, run me. I'm gonna get it back right now. No, at your house, ma'am. Don't, don't do that. Uh, uh. Don't push on me. No, ain't no happy nice day. No, run me my. Uh, uh. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Like I said, I'm not leaving here. No, you're stealing. You're stealing. That's called grand theft that's called grand theft yes yes are you pushing me listen i told you no i'm telling you to run me my run me my son phone okay i gotta call the cops well go ahead call the cops i don't give a fuck i care you really think i can no i'm gonna get his phone here because as soon as the cops come i'm gonna say she stole a fifteen hundred dollar phone and you going to jail from the principal. Today, ma'am, I'ma either get my phone right now or I'ma take it out of somewhere you're not gonna like. Yo, I'm telling you, run me my son's phone. You see what I'm saying? I'm not coming back nothing because I'm not leaving. I'm getting the phone right now. Watch, watch me, watch me, ma'am. Don't push, don't push on my foot. Don't push on my foot. Do not push on my foot. Thank you, thank you. Y'all see how trouble she is? You see who she is, guys? She's still kissing. No, no, you're not. Listen, if you don't run me my son's phone, I'm going to call the principal. I'm going to let the board know. Don't We're going to have you. So you need to don't be fired. You need don't to be fired. You need to give me my phone now. Okay, okay. So I'm about to let them know. Social media, this is oh. Miss Green. She is my son's teacher, and she stole his phone. And what's really phone. even... what's What's more weird about the whole situation, Miss Green, <laughs> is, that, Green yeah. is that... Miss Green is that... Why is the phone here? Usually stuff like that, if you confiscate it, it, it does what? It stay at the school. Why is it here in your house? Like that's, that's, that's so, that that's is so, important. that's, that's real that's important. important. Cause that's why is it here? Yo, you guys, that's she important. took my son's phone this morning and so instead of returning the phone by the end of the day, she didn't even return the phone by the end of the day and I'm his mom and she know I'm his mom, mom and I, she I, still I won't return my son's property. Ma'am, you confiscated the phone. You're his mom. Where's the phone? You said First of all, me and you already had our parents teaching me then don't play with me don't play with me you saw me at open house yeah you was all like oh i can't wait can't sing again you was doing all of that oh you know so you don't remember that you don't remember you was then but now you 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 a thief so it's either it's either give me run me my son's phone or i'm gonna let the principal and everybody know everybody already know you a thief right now because i'm really gonna upload this you better run my you are a thief though why is the phone here you right why is the phone here why is the phone here? And your son would get his iPhone phone. iPhone says it's phone real hot. Have the iPhone tension. says that it's hot. No, and school. he can be on his phone because I bought no, it. He if he want to be on his phone, he can be on his phone. his phone. Well, it doesn't give no you the right to steal allowed. people's no property. And I'm no going to let the police allowed. know. I'm going to call the police and have them come here and get it because that's grand theft. You already stole about $1,500 worth of merchandise. No, the phone will be right now. Why are you like this? Why won't you run me the phone? The phone be at school tomorrow. You're so That's weird. You're so weird. Like, look at how weird these teachers is. You gotta be careful with people like this. Look at them. Look at them. I'm gonna pick it up right now. Ma'am, ma'am. Please stop playing in my face. No, do not, do not push my foot. No, don't touch me. Don't touch me. What did I say? What did I say? Okay, okay, I'm calling the police. What in the name of Karate Jaji is going on here? Miss Green rang a strong, you know. You, Miss Green, you confiscate the phone, right? Why is the phone at your house? Isn't isn't that um a part of the school property? That's supposed to become a part of the school property now, right? Listen to me. Viewers, subscribers, more to the comment down below and tell me what you think about this. Why is the phone at Miss Green House? Now, I do some fact check and I get to understand that. Miss Green was arrested and charged for grand theft. Possession of stolen property. 
and some of the charges same way and she lose all her work. Miss Green rang and uh, Miss Green strong. What do you think? What do you think, say, Miss Green did want the student to come for the phone at her house? Boy, I don't know. I don't know. What do you think? Could Miss Green, as a teacher, be so naive to take the phone and take it to her house? Knowing the repercussion that this would cause. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section. Because I can't answer. But for an joke aside though. I have to point out the fact that Miss Green. Um, is uh, saying that uh, the child was more focused on the phone than doing his work yeah parents we have to address the elephant in the room too you know yeah we have to address the elephant in the room don't get me wrong now i don't come for me you know i'm not saying that miss green is right to bring home the phone i'm just pointing out that dear is a situation right there leading to the phone being taken away if that child behave like a normal child listen to the teacher and all these things his phone would not be confiscated right but why still go back to this how the phone reach a miss greenhouse Anyway, this that maybe come back in our next episode. <laughs> as I want to take a look, as I want to appear into a field, listen, I don't know about the rest of the parents. Them. You see me, look. Now, me reach, a, me reach a work 7 or 8 o'clock every morning. You see me? Me and the eyeglass. You see this projecting on a send come to my yard, it now going to work out. What happened to art and class? We don't teach art and class at school again. Because when we are little youth, art and classroom is one of the most excited lessons that we want to learn. We know you to start them business through art and craft when they learn how to print and them something there. You see me? We know when we used to go to school, everything we name, drama. You know the little amount of artists that come out of drama class who learn to sing, who learn to beat this, who learn for this, who learn for that. You understand? Them class there are how you teach kids and how kids bond with kids who them are compete against who them are whatever are them are. The man and friend are push to get something done. On the teacher nowadays, I do it backward. Saying two, three o'clock in the morning, me reach home, my girl have a blouse and skirt the project, while my child have to sleep. Because the child asleep, I'm a B, I do the project, and I'm a child do it, she don't learn nothing. You understand? Boom, following week, I want big tree, me see in a house, daughter asleep, B, I feel I try done project, if you go to work in the morning, listen to me, it now go work out. Me, I want the parents on the eyeglass. I'm sure no some my girl on the eyeglass. You see me? Sure, 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 sure. Uno back of this man. I can't deal with it. You see me? Uno for get up and do. Uno blows and skirt work. Teach the youth them. Have art and classroom where kids go and learn and bond. Whether them things build good, whether they not build good, they appreciate it. You understand because that's all them learn, that's all them that's all them decide them future, that's all them decide them likes and them dislike by the things where them go go learn. When them the home in a bed while we fear do project, they're not learning anything. Teachers, get on yourself together, man. Don't agree with me. You're watching Jamaica YouTube TV. So we get it exactly how we tell it. No fabrication, you got it? So just like, share, subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification bell and little bless outside saying, And well, well, well. Me love Jamaica, me now sell out. Them try clip we wing, somehow we can't fly out. But when we there, yard, nothing nice like Jamaica. Roast bread, fruit and banana. Under the tree with a glass of...